guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to do a review over the uh, Sally Hansen Airbrush Spray Makeup. I did get it in the color white. This is actually something I got off of Yertle um, not too long ago. So if you're interested in Yertle, I'll leave a link for that below and you can go check them out. But uh, my cat's up here. He's getting into stuff about to. He was, he was thinking about it. You know, when you have pets, you can just kind of tell what they're thinking before they do it. So I look at him and then stopped trying to get into my foundation. Okay, enough rambling. You know I like to ramble. I like to talk. Anyways, I wanted to do a first impressions on this, uh, this, 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 <laughs> um, airbrush spray makeup from Sally Hansen. I just thought it might be kind of fun. So directions on the back. Shake well, spray directly into hand, and apply on face. Blend evenly and complete with a flawless look. Um, I kind of just want to spray it on my face, though. I've seen a lot of other videos um, for other types of spray aerosol foundations that people can just spray directly on their face. And that's honestly why I got this. So, without further ado, shake it. Makes me think of, what, is that Smash Mouth? And the only part of it that I can think of is shake it, shake, shake, shake it. Oh, that's, what is that? I should know this. I love that song. It's about like, when the windmill's falling down. I can't remember the name of the band. <sighs> I love them though. They're really good. Uh, well, that one song in particular, I don't know that I know anything else from them. So, I should have brought a hair tie in here to pull all my hair out of the way. We'll just do it like this. And uh, that smells really, 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 really good. And it made my eyebrows look brown. Look blonde. My eyebrows now look blonde. <laughs> Maybe it's not a bad thing. Um I don't know if I need to blend anything. I don't know. Uh, it's not really wet when it comes out, honestly. Like, it feels pretty dry. I don't know how they'd be putting it in your hands and then putting it on your face. But it smells so good. I can't get over how... I've never had makeup smell this good before. Um, I take my ring off so I don't get makeup all over it. And I'll try putting it in the palm of the hand real quick. Okay, that's kind of what it looks like right there. which one works, works better but it's already pretty much dry in my hand so I feel like that's not the best way to go about it because it's already dry I'm just do a giant glob right here that's how that works I, I like the way it smells I gotta be honest like if they had a perfume scent of this I would wear it I like the way that smells um as far as doing everything like foundation and stuff though I think it's more I mean it didn't do bad I definitely had more redness over here and now I don't my nose doesn't look so red oh well if my nose ran I bet that looks nasty now I don't have a lot of redness over here. So I think it does quite a bit for correcting redness in the face, but I would still say it's more for like a lighter coverage day. Not something when you want like a super flawless look, but if you just want like a little something to help conceal any redness. And I did put this on with no primer. I mean, y'all know I love my e.l.f. primer. And normally I put that on. I didn't think about it. I <laughs> just put it on. Um, but it dries. Like I wouldn't even need to set this with a powder because it's just, it, it's dry. There's nothing there that needs to be set. Um, like I said, I don't think that putting it in your hand is the best way to go because, I mean, I went back for that second little bit and it was dried on my hand. Like, there really wasn't anything there to pick up. Um, yeah, I, I'm just, I'm impressed with um, how it got rid of the redness in my face. I normally, you know, I have a lot of redness naturally. And 
I think that's pretty good. So if you if it's just a quick day where you just need to get out the door, maybe throw on a little bit of lip gloss and some mascara, spritz your face with this real quick. Um, I did do two coats, and I think that'd be pretty good. So I think that's going to wrap up my uh, first impressions on the Sally Hansen spray foundation, spray makeup, whatever. Um, again, mine is in the color light, but I just can't get over how good it smells. Jeez, like I said, I would wear that as a perfume. That smells amazing. Um, but that's it for this video. I know it was really pretty quick. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Leave any comments down below. Let me know if you guys have tried this stuff before. It's the first I've ever heard of it. Um, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys. See what I'm working with? Trying to set up my workspace, and I gotta share it with the cat. It's okay. Help yourself. No worries. You're not in the way or anything. It's cool. Are you coming to help? Oh, okay. Just, just jump down and we're just going to switch out. Like my setup. I feel on top of a milk crate. On top of a folder holder thing. Yeah. It's pretty sophisticated. Okay. You're not in the way either. It's just do you, boo. It's cool. Just check everything out. Are you, like, inspection here to make sure it's safe? Let me stick my face in there.